What's up guys, it's King Daddy DMAC and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Woohoo, here on the Pooping Evolved server. Oh baby, getting so good at those flips now, so good. How's everybody doing today? You doing good? Man, I am so pumped, so pumped, so excited to be back on Vanilla. Man, oh man, last episode. We got this super cool guy. Look at him, level 163 already. Oh man, our super cool centipede, and he's got more level ups. Oh man, what should we level up? More speed. I want to make this guy a speed demon. I want him to be so fast, but he has been pretty cool. We also went and caught one on modded yesterday. And yeah, that one, pretty insane. That one's over level 1000, so make sure to go check it out. But man, so super cool. And I thought today maybe we could play around with some more stuff in the update. Maybe catch a higher level one of these Lystro guys. Oh, baby, he's so happy. He's like, yes, I want a friend. We got to get a friend for Spud. So good. Oh, and we got to figure out how can we take better advantage of getting the special ability from these guys. Getting their super cool level up ability. I think that would be good, don't you? Ah. So very neat. We also got to figure out how to make him do a flip. But guys, thank you so much for the amazing support that you've been giving on the episodes. I really do appreciate it. Please, please, please remember to continue it by leaving those thumbs up and those wonderful comments. Oh, it's so terrific. I can't wait to see what you guys said we should name this guy. I asked for you guys to help me out, so I'm going to go check in a moment. And we'll figure out what will your name be. Oh, you're so awesome. So super cool. So, other things. In the update, of course, we have the new monkey boss, the new ape, the mega pithecus, or whatever the heck it's called. I don't know if we're going to be getting that today, but we also got some super cool new weapons. Yes, I think it's called the bolus. Let's check it out. <gasps> there it is. Sweet. Wind it up and throw. Okay. So what does this cost to make? Not bad. It's just fiber, stone, um, yeah, fiber, stone, and thatch. Sweet. Well, we got all that stuff. Why don't we craft it up and see what this bad boy do? All right, a couple of those. A little bit of that. Uh huh. Looks good. And stone to round it off. Sweet. Let's see how many of these we can craft up. Forty. Bam. Awesome. Now what do these weigh? All right, so they're not that heavy. They do stack. Oh, that is sweet. Let's go ahead, let's check it out. So go ahead, press four. All right, I got it in my hand. Now what do I do? If I right click. Whoa, he winds it up. Wind up for the swing. Yes. Oh, that's amazing. That's so amazing. All right, and then do I just let go? Did it do it? Did it do it? Wind up for the throw and get faster, faster. Bam! I don't see where it went after that, but that's pretty cool. Let's do it again. All right, do I have it out? Do I have it out in my hand? Okay. Now what if I right click? Right click does nothing, so it's just left click. Awesome. I want to be able to see it. Oh, that is awesome. This thing is so cool. Why don't we see what we can do with it? I think you can tame stuff with it, knock stuff out, make it not mobile. Why don't we bring a little bit of this with us too? Yeah, we got a lot more to craft. Let's go out and let's see if we can get something with this. I think it'll be awesome. All right, got all the boluses made up. Super cool. And I also think we should get our stealthy armor on. The stealthy King Daddy armor. The stealthy WMD. Oh, man, we're a rock star. Pretty cool. Also, I went back into the comments and checked out what you guys said. And what do you think about this? I loved it. WMD Noodle. Oh, we're, I was between Noodle and Squiggle Wiggle was what I suggested last episode. But... I don't know, we already got a squiggle wiggle on one of our uh, plezies, so I thought Noodle would be perfect. I love it. Oh, Noodle, it makes you not seem as creepy. 
I love it. WMD noodle. All right, so we got all of our stuff. Let's go out. Let's get sunburst. Come on, sunburst. And I want to go on a quest just in case we need to stand on it when throwing this thing. Let's see. What can we do? What can we find? Right after I stop and get this. What are we going to get? Come on. Something good. Don't give me a crop plot. Oh, water jar. Why? Always, always get the cruddy ones. This is why I generally only go for yellow or red. <gasps> Check out this guy. All right. This is going to be a test subject. Oh, ooh. I don't know. Should we wait for him to land? Can we get him while he's in the air? I'm pretty sure we can get him while he's in the air. All right. We got our little thing. Come on. Oh, he moves around a lot. I don't know if I can do this. Got you. Oh, that's awesome. And look at that. I totally was expecting him to go into the water and he didn't. That is so cool. Look at that. So he didn't fall in the water. He's not drowning. Oh, Lordy, that is awesome. So I guess we have to, like, knock him out. It doesn't knock him out. It just traps him. Oh, that's so cool. Wait, where'd he go? Was that just glitched out that he was up there? All right, and now he's off. All right, that's sweet. What else does this work on? So it works on pteranodons. Oh, God, bug, go away. Go away, bug. I'm trying to do a video, bug. I do not interrupt your YouTube videos. Don't interrupt mine. All right, where were we? Piggy. Can we get a phenomia? Ooh, I want to get this guy again. Get him. Got you, foo. All right, now let's get this guy. Oh, and it just traps him. So it's almost like a bear trap or something along those lines. I don't know. Look at you. Oh, you're so cute. Now, I bet you we could then, if we didn't want to waste our bullets, he's trapped. Let's see if we can just club him out. You're only at level 16. Oh, and look, we can take it back if we wanted. Suck it. Get knocked out. No. Oh, is he untrapped now? Yeah, he's untrapped. All right, you're a lucky one. You are a lucky one. And you're untrapped now, too. All right, we got to get this arranged so that we can do both things. Let's go there. Let's go there. <gasps> a Dilo. A Dillo. A Spitty. Let's get the Spitty. Got you. Can you still spit at me? Can you still spit at me? He doesn't spit. That's pretty cool. What now, soccer? So this could definitely be used for early game. Hopefully. Are you going to fall down? What the heck level are you? This is an ascendant club. You get knocked out already? Oh man. Oh man. You're almost knocked out. All right. So it doesn't last that long. You kind of got to get into it right away. I could see it being very useful for the flyers. But for the little guys, it's almost pointless. I guess they don't attack you, though, while you're doing it. Now, I'm curious what would happen if someone's riding a dino and you use this trickery on them. That would be interesting. Would it dismount them? Now, let's see. What about a parasaur? Can we get a parasaur? Can I get you? Oh, man. We are so awesome. Got you! So it works on parasaurs. Sweet. I don't even care about you. You can just get... Oh, oh, we can take it back. That's right. Let's not waste it. Let's not waste it. Oh, awesome. Ooh, that's a level 108. All right. So what's the next size thing? More pteranodons. What about... Oh, oh, this could be super useful. Totally. Oh! So far, my favorite thing. 
Now, I'm curious if he'll be aggro at me once I remove it. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I'm gonna get you, bro. You just try it. All right, and I guess once it's removed, they stop getting angry. Where's the, where's the guy that we trapped? I think he already broke through it. Bug, you leave me alone, bug. All right, that's a super useful thing, because of course we can just get them knocked down, get them to not move, and then be able to knock them out super quick. So, very cool. Let's see, what else is there that we can test this on? A toidle. I, I'm almost guaranteeing that it works on a toidle. Did it work on you? Oh, I don't think it did. He's mad at me, so we definitely hit him. Yeah, doesn't work on him. All right, good to know, good to know. And if it doesn't work on one, you can't take it back, of course. So another good thing to know. So it works on parasaurs, doesn't work on tur turtles. Um, What else, what else can we test it on? RGs. Will it work on an RG? Will it work on you? Come here, RG. Be so awesome if it did. I'm pretty sure it's going to be too big. Come on, this is making me tired. Now, it doesn't use up stamina. I'm kind of surprised that they didn't make it use up stamina because it seems like that would be something it should do. All right, we totally whiffed there. Come on, RG. All right, another whiffer. Don't draw me out too far. All right, hits him, doesn't work. Oh, that would have been amazing if it worked on him. All right, let's get out of here. Let's scoot. All right, now other dinos that would be small. Raptors, sabers. Those could all be potentially really good ones, and I don't know if they can claw through it. So I think we need to try some of those. Oh man, it's getting foggy. Oh, Dodic. Dodic. Well, we're gonna Dodic. This could be amazing. Level 8 Dodic. Yep, doesn't work on a Dodic. So it's seeming, I guess, if, if we were to classify animals, it's seeming like anything that you could pick up with an RG so far we're able to do. Definitely with a Pteranodon. That would be in that weight class. I guess that would be one of the best ways to, to classify that or else what gate something can fit through. We haven't tried a trike yet. And you know what? The phenomia can be picked up by an R. Oh, crap. What's tacking? Go away, bugs! We should try it on a bug. Alright, we haven't tried it on a dodo. We haven't tried it on a compi either, but this is a little ridiculous. You're getting ridiculous. We can try it at a dodo at home. I really want to try a sa- Ooh, ooh, one of these little guys. What level are you? Level 12. Uh-uh. Now what about trapping you? Gotcha! Did it work on him? It worked on him. Removed. You can go on your way, buddy. Let's see. Maybe the Dead Island would be a better place to do this. This is a bit scary here. All right, here we go. Let's try it on a scorpion. Will it work on a scorpion? I'm gonna get you, buddy. I'm gonna get you! Don't squiggle wiggle so much! Oh my god! Oh, it worked on a scorpion! I'm gonna get you, bro. So this is also a great way to get out of trouble. If you got something attacking you... Why are you walking sideways, bro? If you got something attacking you, you can do that and then they'll leave you alone. Can I take my thing back? Oh, 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 oh! 
I want my things back. I don't want to waste them if I don't have to. Oh, okay, you didn't have one on in the first place, so. <laughs> All right, time to get out of here. So it works on Scorpion. So, so far, yeah, every I, everything that I can pick up with an RG, I've been able to do. Anything that has to be picked up with a Quetz doesn't work. Let's see. So we got Raptors, we got Sabres. We haven't tried Anklo. If my theory's correct, Anklo should not work. All right, you chill out, Birdie. All right, Anklo didn't work. Let's get the heck out of here. All right, Raptor Sabres, and I suppose Dire Wolves too would be another one. We'll try it. We're going to test them all. All right, we're over on the dead island, and there's a saber. I'm going to get you, saber. I'm going to get you. Come here. Come here. Oh, whiffer, whiffer. Yes! Worked on the saber. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, go away. He still tried to attack me, I noticed. Can you still... Yeah, he still can attack me, but he doesn't... It just prevents his movement. Okay. Run, 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 run. Run, run, run. Sorry, buddy. You were just part of science. You're just part of science. All right, we got a raptor over here. That one's about to die. Carno should not work. So we'll try and see if we can find a better area to do Carno. Man, look at all these Carnos. All right, this might be a decent spot to test the Carno. See if we can get part. Little bit higher. Can I park there? Okay, I don't think the Carno can hit us. All right, we're safe. Oh, no, maybe not. Oh, oh, get up, get up. Like, I'm, I'm positive the Carno's not going to work, but we got to test this for science. All right, I'm going to start swinging so I can make a fast getaway. Come on, Carnos. Do your thing. All right, didn't work just like I thought. Definitely, yeah, definitely didn't work. Oh my God, let me out of here. Let me out of here. All right, last test over here. We just gotta find a raptor. We did the sabers, the sabers worked. Oh, who's the, is this a person or is this a wild one? Wild quats. Huh. <laughs> I suppose we could try it. It shouldn't work, but if it did, I mean, if it did work and we we didn't try it, that would be horrible. All right, that was a total whiffer. Come on, buddy. What are you doing? He knows we're doing it, and he's like, I'm going to go in the spot that you can't. Go! Total whiff. All right, forget you, buddy. You stay in the dead island. You're going to die. It definitely shouldn't work. Now, can we do this to our own animals is another thing that I'm curious about. Because if we could... That would be amazing. And you know what? We were able to do the Parasaur, and a Parasaur can't be picked up by an RG, so my, my theory there was a little bit flawed. We haven't tried Terror Bird either. Just see what happens. All right, so to my own guy, it didn't do it. It just hit him. So good to know. I would assume Terror Bird would be in the classification that it would work, but we still need more testing. We still need more testing because it did. It worked on the Parasaur, and Parasaurs cannot be picked up by an RG. All right, didn't work on you. 
we didn't try the trike yet. And I mean, I can totally see why it would work on a Parasaur, because Parasaur is the type of animal that's a pain in the butt because it runs away. But I could have seen it possibly working on a trike. That definitely, I could see that being a thing, even though it didn't work. Bronto, I think, would be a waste of the time trying. Ooh, you're a pretty one. You're a pretty one. Get you. Level <laughs> 16. Oh, that's cool. I love, though, with the Pteranodon. I think that's probably the most useful application. Ooh, and I bet a Galmimus, if it worked on that, would be super helpful, too. An Oviraptor? All right. Come on, buddy. Ooh, it worked. It worked. Can I have it back? All right, let's take it back. Leave me alone, bro. Leave me alone. I was just doing science. Oh, yeah. Way better. Awesome. Ooh, Compi. We got to try Compi. Suppose we can try and Compi here. Now, what about these monkeys? We can get the monkey. And we can still do... No. Probably can't do a passive tame with them. All right. What about you guys? Oh, awesome. All right. Remove. Remove. Sweet. Now, do you know what I didn't check? When we remove it, does it actually give it back to us? Or does it is it ruined? You guys can probably tell because you've probably been looking. I have not been looking. All right. T-Rex, once again, probably a waste of time. But we got to do it. Got to do it. Because what if? Uh-oh. And we might have to save that Bronto. For science! Alright, that definitely did not work. Alright, let me help him out. I think this is Drax's Bronto. And he is gonna get murdered. What are you doing, buddy? Just leaving your guy in passive out in the yard. Oh, here we go. Packy. We haven't tried Packy yet. Should work on the Packy. Yep. Works on the Packy. And also, let's take notice. Will we get it back? Yeah, we still lose it. I do not get the actual item back when I remove it. So it's almost pointless to go around and remove. All right. What? Where is he? Got you. It works on him. Got you too! Ha 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 ha. You trapped, you trapped. So they can still attack at me, but they don't break this, which is really cool. Really, really cool. And it gives me time to either knock them out, and I can get more direct headshots. I dig that. I really dig this. I think it's an awesome addition to the game. Now, they, they talk about it being primitive, but it doesn't say primitive there. And I don't know if you had a higher level one, you know, like, what would you do? Why would you, you wouldn't want to throw it away. So it seems like that's just going to be how it's added in. Oh, that's a cool looking terror bird. What level are you? Why are the coolest looking ones always the lowest level? Anyone else notice this? It's always that way. All right. So what do we have left? Dire wolf. And, oh, and we got to try the dire bear. For sure, the dire bear. Oh, there's a galley. Yes, 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 galley. Galley. Please work on galley. Please. Oh, galley's fast. Yes, and it works on a galley. Another super, super duper helpful little thing that we can do. I dig that. 
And also another thing that goes against my whole theory about anything to be picked up by an RG. Because the galley's yet another one that can't. Ooh, cool, red. Nope. All right, um, Gigantopithecus might be interesting, but I don't think you're gonna be able to passive tame anything while it has this on. But still, good to know. Frogs, frog could be cool. Ooh, snakes. Could help for trying to make a getaway. If you got snakes all up on you, we haven't tried Sarcos yet. I'm going to assume the Sarko doesn't work. We got a snake and a Sarko we can test. Hopefully if it works on the snake. Nope, nope, nope. Don't want to get hit. And we're going to have to craft some more up soon. Yep, nope. Don't work. Let's just get out of here. Alright, Froggy. Where are you, Froggy? Where are you when we need you? Yes. Oh, that's an awesome looking frog. Oh, this is dangerous here. This is dangerous here. We gotta hurry. Froggy. Oh, and it works on the froggy. Awesome. All right. Very cool. Very helpful. Um, the Dimetrodon. Where's the Dimetrodon? I know I saw one. Could be one just chilling out here. There we go. Ooh, and it did not work on you. I expected that it would. Yeah, I totally thought that it would. All right, good to know, good to know. I think we've hit everything that's here. Beavers, gotta try beaver. Gotta try beaver too. All right, guys, we got more to test. Got a dire bear. Let's try this puppy out. Ready? I don't expect it to work, but you never know. All right, that that probably did hit. Oh, oh my God. All right. Didn't work. Doesn't work on dire bears. Good to know. Good to know. All right, next I saw a Gigantopithecus right around here. Let's try it on the Giganto. I hope this works, but again, don't know. Oh, whiffer. Oh God, hurry, hurry. All right, didn't work. Oh man, Giganto first bear. No, they're teaming up, they're allies. <laughs> Run, D-Mac. All right, so didn't work on either of those. Here we have Monkey Farms, epic base. Awesome. All right, I saw a beaver and a beaver dam over here for that matter. Now I could see it working on beavers. What the heck's hitting me? Go away, ants. Man, they're just on a mission today to like ruin my video. Go away. All right, I saw a beaver. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What kind of egg is that? It's probably not an egg I care about. Parasaur egg, don't care about. Looks like it could have been a Titan boa. Okay. So, we have right here beaver dam. Do we have a beaver to go with this beaver dam? We should, we should. Where is said beaver? Beaver. Be quite convenient if you were right here. All right, I have a feeling he will reveal himself if we help ourselves. Ooh, nice. Ooh, ooh, love it. You know what? I'm gonna take that too. All right, do we get a beaver to reveal himself? Yes, we do. All right, I I think this could work. I think there's a very good chance that the beaver works. Go, Beaver. Let's wind up. Beaver. Where's the beaver? Where's the beaver? I'm getting tired. 
There he is. Bam! Holy crap, it's a level 72 beaver, and it looks like it did work. Yep, yep, did work. Oh, that's awesome. All right, you stay caught up. Oh, Carno. All right, closer chance at a Carno. Yep, still doesn't work. All right, so beaver works. That's awesome. So for the most part, for the most part, my theory was right. Except for the Parasaur and the Gallimimus. I think that just about everything. So we didn't test Spino. I don't expect Spino to work. I suppose we can test it while we're here. Spino! Who? 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 What's with you, Derpy? You afraid of me? Oh, watch it work. All right, it didn't work. Run, run, run. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. All right, we didn't try fish yet. Fish is another thing. I, I don't see why we'd care about fish. Fish don't have legs, too, so I don't know how they get all that caught up, but it could be a thing. It could be a thing. We never tried a dodo either, did we yet? All right, we're getting low on these things. We only have three left, so I'm gonna have to cr do some crafting up in a moment. Let's just empty this. Okay, we got 10 more. Did not notice that before. All right, so we got a salmon. Can we wind this up underwater as well? All right, that looked like it had no effect. Let's get some fish meat. I kill you, salmon. Where'd it go? It got flung. Saber tooth salmon. Oh, we can drag the body though. Thanks for the fish meat. Oh, dodo, dodo. I'm positive it works on a dodo. Why you'd need it on a dodo? This I do not know. So it works on the dodo. All right, looks like we're gonna head over to the winter biome for our last little tests. Ooh, here's our chance to do bugs. Oh crap. All right, doesn't look like it worked on the bug. All right, guys, next up, dire wolf, dire wolf. All right, where can we park our guy? Ooh, in the Megaloceros. We haven't tried that yet either. Can we get a dire? All right. Let's do this guy first. I can't swing underwater. All right. Bam. Did I get you? You're got. Got you. Awesome. Penguins we haven't done. I'm assuming penguins. We can do. Got you. All right. Cool. All right. Now what I've been avoiding. What I've been dreading. The dire wolf. No, not the saber. We already did the saber. Saber, go away. Come here, doggy. Got you. It works. Awesome. So another way, if you're getting attacked by dyers or whatever, you can just throw one of these at them. So you have enough time to get away. Awesome. We got the mammoth. I, I'm pretty sure we can't do a mammoth. But we might as well try, and the rhino as well. Again, assume I can't, but you never know. All right, just as I suspected. Man, Argies would have been really cool, though. I suppose Argies aren't that hard to tame, though, because they don't fly away. All the stuff that's hard, like, that just runs away from you, we're able to catch. So, for all purposes of why you'd use this, it's there. It's super helpful. A female Megaloceros would be super helpful as well. All right, here we go. Here's our rhino. And then the beavers, it's kind of cool too because you can rope up all the beavers and then be able to get the dam. All right, that's for sure no. You safely go get the beaver dams without them attacking you. And again, this is mostly early game stuff because once you have a quest, so you can pick up most of these things and just put them in a taming pen. But prior to that, prior to having flyers, this is definitely going to be your best friend. Holy! 
So I've been work I've been looking for probably over an hour now, looping the island, and I've had the hardest time finding these Leicester guys in over level 100. So far, I just saw the first one ever. I got a 96 female, which is the highest female I've seen. No, you are not. You're not part of it. Here we go. And a 112. Very nice. So I think we're gonna have to go with it, just judging. I mean, they're not rare. I have no problem finding them. It's just finding high level ones. So they're gonna be tamed up. Look at these split. A 120 only takes three of these rare flowers. And thank you guys for letting me know what they prefer. All right, here it is. Bam, got you. Epic. Pet, pet. Nice. Let's go get the female. Oh, where's the female one? Epic! Oh, baby. So we finally have decent level ones. Not bad. What'd they tame out to? We got a 143. And these are not bad stats. I'm sure these are percentages of the base. So I'm sure the base things are real low. But I mean, that's not bad to start off with these guys are pretty resilient nice all right well you guys are definitely going to go on to neutral you're not going to be attacking anything let me get you a few little berries and we should be all set to go oh it's going to be a journey home man we are like exact opposite side of the island this is about as far as you can get it's okay though because i love you you're cool Oh, and you guys are eating through those berries quick. All right. Well, you know what? I think we're going to call it here. I think we're going to call it here. We got two over level, level 100s. Oh, we should. And we can mate them, too. Oh, should we do baby? Should we do baby today? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I think we're going to have to wait. It's going to take too long. All right. Thank you oh so much for watching, guys. We'll get to the, we'll do a big baby episode next time. Yes, because we still got a lot more breeds to do. But anyway, please remember, leave those thumbs up way high up in the sky. Help me out in the comments. What should we name these two? I'm thinking we want doggy names. That would be cool. Good dog names. What are your, what are your pets names? There we go. There we go. What are our pets names? I love it. All right, guys, till next time. Peace out.